Have you ever had a question about faith or sin or God, and you didn't really know how to answer it or even where to look in the Bible to help you think about it? Well, friends, you are not alone. All this summer, we at St. Paul's are going to take a look at some of the difficult topics and questions that many people have in their hearts and heads. Join us at worship for a sermon series called, Can I Ask That? Each week, beginning the weekend of June 29th and 30th, we will be exploring questions like, how do we read the Bible? Why do bad things happen to good people? Does God discriminate against women? What does the Bible really say? about being gay, and lots more. Our first week's topic will be, how do we read the Bible? Here are this week's Bible passages, how they might help us dig into this topic, and what questions we might want to ask of ourselves. Our first reading will be one of the most famous from the Bible, Psalm 23, the one that begins with the words, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. We'll do a short exercise with this passage to help us understand the wideness of God's word. Our second reading from 2 Timothy, verses 14 through 17, says, All scripture is inspired by God and is useful for teaching, for reproof, for correction, and for training in righteousness. I wonder what happens when we have doubts about God and scripture. Can we still find value there? And finally, we have the Gospels, those storied accounts of Jesus' life, teachings, and miracles. And in John 20, 30, and 31, we're reminded that these accounts are laid down so that we can do more than learn about God, also so that we can come to believe in Jesus. We will explore together how we might wrestle through our trust issues and the Bible's contradictions to discover our beliefs. I encourage you to spend a little time this week reading and praying over these passages and to invite the Holy Spirit to illuminate those places in your life where they connect and how God's abundant grace might help us approach this week's question, how do we read the Bible? Next week, our topic will be, can I do something so bad that God won't forgive me? We will be digging into the following text to help us with this question, Genesis 3, 8 through 13, Romans 7, 14 through 8, 2, Mark 3, 28 to 29, and Luke 23, 32 to 34. So come, join us as we take a step into these uncomfortable, but also grace-filled conversations about some topics that we encounter in our everyday lives.